Hi. Welcome to the Professional Certifications Channel. In this video, we will explore common questions asked by JCI surveyors and provide answers on the Access to Care and Continuity of Care ACC. What is the process for managing patient who notify staff that they wish to discharge or leave against medical advice? When a patient expresses a desire to discharge or leave the hospital against medical advice AMA, it's important for healthcare providers to handle the situation carefully to ensure the patient's safety and to document the process appropriately. Here's the general process for managing a patient who wishes to leave AMA. 1. Initial Notification Patient Communication The patient informs a member of the healthcare team, such as a nurse, physician, or other staff, of their desire to leave the hospital against medical advice. The staff member should acknowledge the patient's request and inform them that the appropriate healthcare provider will speak with them about their decision. 2. Assessment and Discussion Clinical Assessment The attending physician or a senior healthcare provider should promptly assess the patient's medical condition to determine the potential risks associated with leaving the hospital AMA. This assessment may include a review of vital signs, recent test results, and the patient's overall clinical status. Discussion with the patient. The physician or healthcare provider should have a thorough and compassionate discussion with the patient to understand their reasons for wanting to leave AMA. During this conversation, the provider should explain the potential medical risks and consequences of leaving the hospital prematurely. Discuss the benefits of staying in the hospital for continued treatment. Address any concerns or reasons the patient may have for wanting to leave, e.g., fear, financial concerns, personal obligations. Offer solutions or alternatives, such as involving social services, arranging a family meeting, or modifying the care plan to accommodate the patient's needs. 3. Patient Education Informed Decision-Making Ensure that the patient fully understands the potential risks and consequences of leaving AMA, including the possibility of worsening their condition, complications, or even death. Provide the patient with information on the specific risks related to their current condition and what might happen if they do not complete the recommended treatment. Documentation of Education Document the discussion in the patient's medical record, including the specific risks explained to the patient their understanding of these risks, and any alternative options offered. 4. Documentation and AMA Form AMA Form If the patient still decides to leave after being informed of the risks, they should be asked to sign an Against Medical Advice AMA, form. This form typically includes a statement that the patient has been informed of and understands the risks of leaving AMA. An acknowledgement that the patient is choosing to leave despite the medical advice given. A release of liability for the hospital and healthcare providers regarding any adverse outcomes that may result from leaving AMA. Refusal to sign. If the patient refuses to sign the AMA form, this refusal should be documented in the medical record. The healthcare provider should note that the patient was informed of the risks and chose to leave without signing the form. Medical Record Documentation Thoroughly document the entire process in the patient's medical record, including The patient's stated reasons for wanting to leave The content of the discussion with the patient, including the risks explained The patient's decision to leave and whether or not they signed the AMA form Any instructions or follow-up care recommended to the patient before they left 5. Discharge Process Discharge Instructions Provide the patient with discharge instructions, even if they are leaving AMA. These instructions should include Information on how to manage their condition at home Warning signs and symptoms that should prompt them to seek immediate medical attention Contact information for follow-up care or emergency services Prescriptions and medications if appropriate, provide any necessary prescriptions or medications that the patient may need after leaving the hospital. 6. Notification and follow-up. Notify the care team. 
Inform the entire healthcare team, including the attending physician, nursing staff, and any relevant specialists, of the patient's decision to leave AMA. Family Notification If the patient consents, notify their family or next of kin about their decision to leave AMA, especially if the patient's condition is serious. Arranging Safe Transportation Ensure that the patient has a safe way to leave the hospital, especially if they are at risk, e.g., arranging transportation if they are impaired or unable to drive safely. Follow-up care If possible, arrange for follow-up care or provide information on how the patient can access care after leaving, such as contact details for their primary care provider or outpatient services. 7. Review and Quality Improvement Case Review some hospitals may review cases where patients leave AMA to identify any patterns or opportunities for improving patient care and communication. Quality Improvement Use the information from AMA cases to enhance patient education, address common concerns that lead to AMA discharges, and improve overall patient satisfaction and safety. Example Scenario Patient, John Doe Condition, pneumonia, advised to stay for intravenous antibiotics and monitoring. Patient request, wishes to leave hospital AMA to attend to personal matters at home. Discussion with physician. Dr. Smith explains the risks of leaving without completing treatment, including the possibility of worsening infection, respiratory failure, and the need for readmission. Patient insists on leaving, citing urgent personal obligations. Documentation Discussion documented in the medical record, including the patient's understanding of risks. AMA form presented to the patient who signs it. Discharge instructions Patient given instructions to continue oral antibiotics at home, monitor for worsening symptoms, and seek immediate care if necessary. Follow-up appointment scheduled with primary care physician. Notification Care team informed of the patient's decision. Family notified with the patient's consent. Conclusion By following this process, healthcare providers can ensure that patients who choose to leave AMA do so with full awareness of the potential risks, and that their decision is well documented to protect both the patient and the healthcare team.